What's happening, Adventureland? This idea is so simple and so brilliant, I can't believe I didn't think about it. I need something to hold my water bottle on my belt securely while I was up in a tree. Somebody posted this on one of the arborist groups and I think it's brilliant. Check it out. Okay, these are the supplies that you're going to need. You'll need a knife, uh, some sort of paracord, a very inexpensive carabiner, a lighter, and then a bottle that you are likely to use repeatedly. And what I mean by that is, if you are the person that goes to the store and buys those 40 packs of water bottles, then you'll want to make your measurement against that size of a mouth. Um, but if you would rather have Gatorade bottles, big bottles, um, with a larger size mouth, you'll want to make your measurement against that size. Here's what we're going to do. You're going to make a bend called a fisherman's bend or a double fisherman's bend actually because it's hard to see it on a small piece of rope i'm going to show you on a larger rope and carabiner how you tie a double fisherman's knot so i've got my rope through the carabiner and what i'm going to do here is just grab the two ropes together and i'm going to wrap this rope around it once and back towards the carabiner and then wrap it again right? And then I'm going to grab these two loops right here, this section, and I'm going to stick the rope through. And now you've got a double fisherman's knot or a double fisherman's bend. And then that cinches down. Um, you'll take your carabiner and you will take some slack here. You're going to wrap it around twice and then after you've wrapped it twice you're going to stick it underneath this loop and this loop right here All right, very simple and then that cinches down now what i would normally do as well is go ahead and cut this off and then just burn the end. All right, nice and neat. The next piece is where you have to actually do a little bit of measuring. It's This is how I do it because I really like things to be kind of compact. I don't want a large six inch string with my bottle hanging from it, right? I want it to be close to the carabiner. So what I'll do is let me cut a section of rope here. I'm taking about 12 inches. All right, so the next piece is to take the bottle and just wrap the string around it to get a rough estimate of how much you're going to need, All right? That's a good length so that the carabiner and the bottle are kind of close together there. And I'm going to now do my double fisherman's. So I'll wrap it once, twice, and then you're gonna go underneath. All right, let's see. Perfect, I do. All right, so you don't want to cinch this double fisherman's down too much. Um, you, you do want to cinch it down so that it's, there's some tension there, but remember, you have to be able to open and close that knot. All right, now I'll cut the end. Yep, and then I'll just kind of Smash it down there after it's cooled down just a little bit. Pressed against the end, it won't come loose. And that's essentially it. I mean, it's super easy. You can slap this on your backpack. You can put it on your belt if you're if you're um, you know doing tree work or if you're rock climbing or something. And it just hangs below you. Very simple, very easy, very inexpensive device to use for holding your water bottle. Uh, you see what I mean though, right? If you make your measurement against a smaller mouth water bottle, you're not gonna be able to really use it on like a Gatorade bottle or you know uh, something that's got a larger uh, mouth on it. However, if you made it for a Gatorade bottle, you could use it for one of these. It's just that it would hang much lower, which it might not bother you, but it bothers me. So I made mine specifically for this size mouth because I knew that I'd be likely to, to have something like this on me when I was climbing. So hey, pretty cool, right? I mean, cheap, inexpensive, fun to make. You can make one with your kids. Uh, they work fantastic. I've used mine for quite a while. I've had no issues with it whatsoever. 
Hope you enjoyed the show today. And remember, whatever you do today, my friends, stay adventurous. Later.